Hello, I'm Miss Douglas and this is SGN. Hello and welcome back to episode 2 of Balwiri High School's Expressive Arts Some Good News. Still haven't shortened the name. Uh, we are going to begin this week once again with a weather report from uh, Ruby and Archie. So, boys. <laughs> Absolutely, completely agree. Thank you, Ruby and Archie. Now, we're going to start this week with our food section. Um, this is quite teacher-led this week, as um, I don't think anyone was baking this week. I think we were kind of quite enjoying the rather nice weather outside, which is absolutely fine. But given that the rain's about to hit any day now, we'd love to see what you've been baking. Miss Charlie made some gluten-free uh, brownies. Um, they were very nice. She sent me a photo of them, um, which you are about to see. You will notice that there's not that many on the plate, um, which we're taking as a good thing because they got eaten before we could get the photo done. And Mr Harlow had an adventure this week. Um, he messaged to inform me that he'd managed to eat all of the Haribo without his wife noticing. Good start. And then messaged two hours later to retract the statement because his wife noticed. I think it was a slightly awkward household this week with uh, the Haribo stealing because I think he tried it again after. <laughs> Now, on to animals. You know we love an animal. Uh, Greg, in third year, has a new dog. Um, it's one of the wee sausage dogs that I can never pronounce the name properly, so we'll call it a sausage dog, um, who is very small and likes to trip you up and actually ridiculously cute. So, here's a photo. Now to music. Emma, in third year, has learned three songs on the bass which is really impressive. And we also have Connor, also in third year, who has been learning to improvise scales and has also learned to play a new piece on the guitar. And we have a wee example of that here. <laughs> Connor. And now to art. Uh, Miss Taylor has finished the school's values embroidery. This is something that was um, started by our second years back when we were still at school um, and has been put together into a broader tapestry of sorts. Um, it is very impressive and all of those second years that took part should be very impressed with their achievements. It is on our website for those of you that wish to have a clearer look but I have a couple of photos here for you to see. And now on to our general news. Mrs Normand has a new outdoor swing set for her children, so she says, but we all know they're true. Um, and a lot of people have been sharing great news about getting to see friends at parks, having um, barbecues, socially distant barbecues. All this news is amazing to see, as long as we are still remembering to socially distance, um, making sure that our hands are all washed, not touching things that other people have had, and so on and so forth. Um, very excited to have you all uh, meet people. I personally had a barbecue the other week with Miss Charnley, which was very exciting. We had a wee walk as well, um, and actually managed to see some of you, which was very nice. While socially distanced, of course, very important. And finally, uh, we have been working very hard in the Expressive Arts Department, and a lot of the work that has been uh, done can be found on a variety of platforms. So we're going to share them here. They will also be shared down at the bottom in the description. So you've got a link to them there as well. You can find out lots of information about the Expressive Arts Department through the Balwini High School website. That is our first port of call at all times. Art also have an Instagram and their Instagram is balwini.hs underscore art 
and their Twitter page is at Balweary Art. So you can find lots of information there as well. And um, their Instagram's great, they've got lots of pictures. They had uh, drawing challenges as well. Um, it's really great to see all of the amazing um, effort that our pupils are putting in. In drama, they have an Instagram and it is Balweary Drama. Again, check it out, give them a follow. There'll be lots of great things being posted onto there. And the music department, we have at Balweary Music, that is our Twitter. Also, we have a YouTube page, which I'm assuming you're watching this on. If you're not, we are on YouTube at Balweary Music. Um, and also on that page, for those of you that are seniors that are hoping to, that are taking music next year, there are lots of uh, pieces for you to watch. Um, and we dropped today, so um, Friday the 12th of June, we dropped our spring concert. Now, normally we have a concert at the end of term just before the Easter holidays. Obviously that didn't happen. So what we have um, created is an online virtual concert of our own. Um, some of our senior pupils um, sent in videos. We have a choir number. Um, it's really great. We will link to the playlist in the description as well. And um, would really love it if you would watch and support all our young pupils being amazing. Um, remember, fill out the form send me all your good news and uh, next week hopefully we'll get to you yours. That is it for episode two of Balweary High School Expressive Arts Some Good News. Uh, I am Miss Douglas, goodbye. <laughs>